Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I got some breaking news just before I lay down. And I thought, well, I'll wait until I get a nap, and then I'll be more apt to <laughs> tell it right. Okay, um, I got this from Kathy. She said they just did a live um, video on it. It's titled, Internet Shutdown Soon Coming dash mj now i'm not sure what that means it's a, it was found on 444 prophecy news site posted august 2nd 8 27 a.m on the sunday morning news today on a big tv network they were attacking any internet news site that is presenting anything else than the narrative that they're telling us on the mainstream media. They were saying that the rise in COVID cases is due to online conspiracy theories. Yeah, right. It's the fault of the YouTube people. Right. We're the ones in control. What a bunch of bunk. Some of the dangerous theories were Bill Gates and his ID2020 vaccine agenda, human microchip implants. In other words, we're telling people don't take it. Like it's already out? Well, he's already admitted it'll change your DNA. Oh boy, his ID 2020 vaccine agenda, human microchip implants, the use of hydroxychloroquine, z pack and zinc. Yeah, remember all those doctors? Did any did y'all see that? There was a black woman who learned in Southern Africa. Uh, some oh. Oh, that famous place starts with a Z. Anyway, she treated lots of malaria cases. She did most of the talking on the part I watched. And she said how well the hydroxychloroquine did. So she started using it on her patients in Texas and telling her colleagues about it. And they started using it. And they're swearing by it. I mean, there was at least 18 doctors standing there in front of a crowd of reporters and a lot of them were holding these so I don't think they were all from MSNBC and CNN if you get what I'm saying okay now uh, that was zinc comma the dangers of wearing face masks oh my why don't they just admit it it decreases your oxygen and increases your breathing of your own CO2. Radiation poisoning from 5G cell towers. Oh, and here's the good one. And demonic attacks. They were saying that anyone who believes in these topics is putting people's lives in danger. This should be clear evidence to us that these are the exact topics that they don't want us knowing about or talking about. This is the beginning of thought police. <laughs> beginning, I think it's been going on for a long time, don't you? With with predictive programming they do not want you to have your own thoughts if you disagree with what they present you with you are dangerous or a threat to everyone else's safety the news clip ended with them saying that they will try to quote Crack down on the spread of dangerous information on the internet, unquote. 
Instantly, the Lord put these words in my head. This is how they will shut down the internet. They will say that too many people are dying because they believed the conspiracy theories on the internet. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's what they'll say, but it's... Oh Lord. Once the internet is gone, they will tell you to just believe what they tell you and do what they tell you and we will all be safe and everything will be all right. They will say the vaccine is safe and once we all get it, we can all go back to our nice, safe, normal lives. Remember how the adversary told Eve that the fruit would not make her die? He said the fruit would be good for her and make her be like God. Remember the words of Hosea. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. And that's the end of it. Oh, okay. So, anyway, it was on... I just mistakenly, I was trying to share it to Facebook, but apparently, I'm, I'm, I'm still not real savvy on using a cell phone for anything, but um, I wanted to let y'all know that. It was, again, 444prophecynews.com. All right, I plead the blood of Jesus over this. I pray it goes up and gets shared. People realize what's going on. I don't know if we can stop it. We can pray against it and hope it doesn't happen until the first rapture. Um, and then things will change. They will. And they know it. Okay, so I plead the blood of Jesus over this video, myself, my computer, my internet connection, and over each and every one of you and all of your devices and your internet connections as well. With that, I'll say bye for now. I'll talk to you later.